Hello guys, welcome to DTW Tutorials. Welcome to Friday's Maastricht. Alright, if it's your first time on this channel, I say welcome to you. DTW Tutorial is an educational channel that helps students with their maths in WAEC, that's their WAS, and uh, JAM, post UME, alright? And we also do some um, discovery house stuff works and also we do this math tricks, okay, to make maths more easier for you. Alright, so if this is your first time on this channel, please try to subscribe, okay, just to support me to do more. Please subscribe support this ministry support me to do more all right okay so today we're going to be learning about how to convert fractions to decimals in three seconds you know fractions are quite you know for us to convert to the decimal you know we have to look for a calculator there by our side to quickly do this but you can do this without a calculator in just three seconds let's say for instance uh, you have four divided by seven that's this fraction that this fraction how to convert it to a decimal without using your long division method okay so to do this all you need to do is we we'll draw out our long division all right we put in our seven here put in our four put a dot then put a zero 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 it depends on the amount of zeros you want that's how your answers how many significant figures you want to approximate to okay so how do we do this can four go can seven go in four no we put our zero then point so we put down our four here what is 7 in 40? 7 in 40 would go 5 times. That's 35, all right? And what will remain? That's 30, 40 minus 35. It will remain 5. Okay, so put our 5 here. 7 in 50 will go how many times? 7 times. That's 7 times 7 is what? 49. And we have a remainder of what? 1. We'll put our 1 here. 7 in 10 will definitely go 1 times. And what's our remainder? We have a remainder of 3. And 7 in 30, how many times will it go? It will go 4 times that's 28 okay and 30 minus uh, 28 that will give us a 2 we can add another 0 here put 2 and 7 in 20 would go how many times 2 times that's 14 and we have a balance of how many that will be a 6 okay so we can just stop here all right and uh, uh we can say our answer is what zero point what five seven one it depends on the uh, um, significant figure you are approximating to so um you give your answer according to what you are being asked by your the the examiner all right so let's say, take another example let's say we have eight divided by nine how do we convert this to a fraction quickly so we write our nine here put it in and we have point zero 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 all right and we say what nine in eight can it go no we put a zero point okay and we'll take our eight here and nine in 80 would go how many times eight times that's 72 and what will be our balance when we subtract 72 from 80 we're going to have what eight and nine in 80 again is going to give us a eight and a balance of eight and nine in 80 is going to give us a eight and a balance of eight and nine in 80 is going to give us a eight and a balance of eight so it's going to go all so on and so on so you can just drop your answer it depends on how uh, the examiner asks you to approximate okay so our answer for this is what 0 0.8888 okay so thank you for staying tuned to destined to win tutorials see you in our next video where we'll take an, on another maastricht thank you please try to subscribe like and share this video bye